everyone and welcome back to my channel myself dr surbhi sani the host and the founder of the channel dr surbhi sani dental series and medical videos and welcome back to my youtube channel as you already know that in the previous days already oral surgery videos are out on my channel so you can check out in the playlist of oral surgery on my channel now today also i am going to talk about a new topic of oral surgery so without wasting time let's get started with the topic but before that let me tell you something as i am going to cover the la part or the la series as you read in the final year of dentistry in oral surgery then i will cover the videos in two ways one in the english and second in the hindi the same topic you will understand in both the languages whether it is english or whether it is hindi if you like this concept then hit the like button to all my videos and to this video if you are new on my channel do subscribe my channel and share my videos as much as you can now today's topic is the electrophysiology of nerve conduction This topic is very very important in oral surgery as well as you read this topic in physiology also. If we talk about the electrophysiology of nerve conduction, then it is in certain step. The first, we need the stimulus which can excite the nerve. Say this is the nerve, and this is the stimulus which we need so that there is some changes in this nerve. Right now, this nerve is at resting position with the potential of minus seventy mV. mV is the millivolt, right? So at present, this nerve is at resting position with the seventy millivolt minus seventy millivolt potential. Now, whenever a stimulus comes, it will excite the nerve. The change in the potential of the nerve. The first step is. there is the slow depolarization of the nerve as the resting potential was minus 70 mv now it get changes to minus 50 or minus 60 mv when this step occur this is known as the slow depolarization of the nerve second step is whenever there is the drastic falling in the rapid depolarization at a critical level then that is known as the threshold potential or firing potential let's say it uh, reaches up to minus 50 mv or the minus 60 mv third step is the rapid depolarization of the nerve in this there is the total reversal of the electrical potential of the nerve now inside the nerve or the interior of the nerve in case of the rapid depolarization we have the positive electrical potential inside the nerve as compared to the outside of the nerve now it reaches up to the plus 40 mv earlier it was 70 minus 70 mv now it has positive 40 mv so that's all about the rapid depolarization after all the depolarization here come the fourth step that is repolarization of the nerve whenever the repolarization of the nerve take place repolarization that means back to its normal state so for that the action potential then again reduce from plus 40 mv and then it come back to its original position or original form that is minus 70 mv so this process is known as the repolarization the fourth step for the electrical physiology or the electrical conduction or in the nerves talk about the whole process as we know we have read already the four steps in this video so the whole process will take place in just 1 millisecond in which the depolarization take 0.3 millisecond while the repolarization of the nerve will take 0.7 millisecond so that's all about this topic regarding the electrophysiology of the nerve conduction a very very important topic to understand this will help to clear your basics whether in oral surgery in case of la or in case of physiology which you read in first year of dentistry 
Now that's all about this video. Hope you like this video and understand it very well. If you still have any query, you can comment down in the comment section of this video. Along with that, stay connected, subscribe to my channel and share my videos as much as you can. If you still have any query, you can drop me the mail which is shown on your screen or you can also follow me on my Instagram with my Instagram ID shown on your screen. I will definitely put the link of my Instagram ID in the description box. So don't forget to check out that. Stay connected, stay healthy. Thank you for watching.